A sinkhole, also known as a cenote, sink, swallow, swallow hole, or doline, is a depression or hole in the ground caused by some form of collapse by the surface layer. Most are caused by karst processes, the chemical dissolution of carbonate rocks, or suffosion processes. Sinkholes vary in size from 1 to 600 meters both in diameter and depth and vary in form from soil-lined bowls to bedrock-edged chasms. Sinkholes may form gradually or suddenly and are found worldwide. Sinkholes are most common in what geologists call karst terrain. These are regions where the types of rock below the land surface can naturally erode or be dissolved by groundwater circulating through them. Soluble rocks include salt beds and domes, gypsum and limestone and other carbonate rock. Occasionally, a sinkhole may exhibit a visible opening into a cave below. In the case of exceptionally large sinkholes, such as the Minye sinkhole in Papua New Guinea or Cedar Sink at Mammoth Cave National Park in Kentucky, an underground stream or river may be visible across its bottom flowing from one side to the other. Geologists divide sinkholes into three types. The first is a dissolution or solution sinkhole. In this type of sinkhole, there is little soil or vegetation over the limestone or other bedrock. Water from rain and runoff slowly trickles through crevices in the bedrock, dissolving it. As a result, a depression gradually forms. Dissolution sinkholes sometimes become ponds if the depression gets lined with debris, trapping the water inside. Dissolution sinkholes happen slowly and are generally not dangerous, but one that becomes a pond can drain subtly if water makes it through the protective bottom layer. The second type of sinkhole is a cover subsidence sinkhole. These sinkholes happen in areas where sand covers the bedrock. The sand filters down into openings in the rock, gradually causing the land surface to sink. Continued erosion increases the size of the depression. Like dissolution sinkholes, cover subsidence sinkholes happen slowly. The third and most dangerous type of sinkhole is a cover collapse sinkhole. In these cases, the bedrock is covered by a layer of clay. Beneath this ground cover, however, water dissolves an underground cavern. Gradually, ground sediments begin to erode, or spall, into the cavern from the bottom. The ground continues to crumble from beneath until only a thin layer remains between the surface and the underground opening. When that layer collapses, the sinkhole opens up suddenly, swallowing any structures on top. There are often warning signs before a sinkhole collapse. The ground may slump noticeably, causing fence poles or trees to lean. Subsidizing soil might also expose buried surfaces of trees or foundations, and a structure threatened by a sinkhole may show small cracks and doors and windows may stick or refuse to shut as the structure subtly settles. As the rock dissolves, spaces and caverns develop underground. These sinkholes are deceptive because the land usually stays intact for a period of time until the underground spaces get too big. If there is not enough support for the land above the spaces, then a sudden collapse of the land surface can occur without warning. Thank you for watching. Make sure to like, subscribe, and share. Join us on Patreon, Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, Discord, and our website at markvnet.com.